Hey guys, what's up? It's Tom here, and uh, we're back, and we are going to be doing a tutorial today. Um, I did a tutorial on this before, but uh, it has got updated, and it is the Dr. Zarek Small Creatures mod. Um, I did a tutorial on this, but uh, I'm after noticing um, that it, has, it did get updated, even though it was still on 1.8.1, but he brought three new animals into it, which uh, look unreal. So... I think it's the crocodiles, turtles, and sc I don't know if it was scorpions. Is it was maybe it was? Yeah, I think it was. Yeah, I think that was the three, which I think they look really cool, and uh, I love this mod. Uh, it's probably one, of my, probably my favorite mod. It just makes Minecraft more um, explorable and fun. So we'll be installing this today. So oh, I'll put the link to this in the forum. Uh, in the forum, I'll put the link to this in the description. Um, you just want to scroll down, you'll see the Mo Creatures mod version 2.14.1 zip, and you just want to download that. And uh, once you get that downloaded, you'll see how to install the Mo Creatures mod. You want to go show, and you'll see download guy API and mod loader plus audio mod. So you just want to click on the both links when you want to a separate forum, and you want to click on the download and download them. So once you get them four mods downloaded, you should have audio mod, the Dr. Zarek's Mo Creatures uh, mod loader, and the Guy API. Before we do any um, installing, make sure we have a backup. So you want to go to your Windows icon, go to the search bar, type in percent app data percent, and you go to Roman. And in here, you'll see a bunch of folders, and you want to put your eye on the one that says dot Minecraft. And this is the folder which basically runs your Minecraft. So we want to back this up in case you have any other mods or anything. Uh, mods can collide and they can give you a black screen, as everyone's familiar with. So you just want to back it up. So you want to right click on it and you want to go copy and you want to wherever you want to paste it. And uh, you just name it backup if you want. It doesn't really matter, just uh, so you can remember what this is. So you want to go backup in case anything does go wrong. So now we just want to click aside your top Minecraft, and uh, if you do have mods, like I said, they can collide. So I'm not giving. If you just a clean Minecraft .jar, for I'll show you now. All you do is do a force update if you want this Mo Creatures mod to work perfectly. But um, if you do have mods, it does work too. It's just it's you have to be really good at installing it, and some mods do collide, like I said. But all you have to do is go to options, and you want to go force update. I've already done it, but all you have to do is click it. And press done. And I'll do it again. Just log in, and I'll start uh, updating your Minecraft again, getting out everything, uh, making you, giving you a brand new dot Minecraft folder. Um, so yes. So once this is done, we will start installing. So I'm gonna go ahead and go back onto the percent app data percent. And percent. Okay, I suppose that wrong. There. Okay, so once that is finished, we will start going into it. So our dot Minecraft is there, and once it is loaded, we will start. Because so now, once you get this on, all you do is exit out of it. And first of all, we're going to be installing the model loader first. So you want to click on your dot Minecraft folder. In here, you'll have a bin. You want to click on that. And you'll have a Minecraft chair, or it could be called Minecraft. Um, it depends, uh, but it could be called Minecraft. Depends what you have it on. It might not put jar file as options on this, uh, so you can find it. Organize, and I think it's folder and search options. And you want to go over here, and you'll see uh, view. Go to view, and if you want to put show hidden folders and drives, that will make show that your Roman folder will come up and other stuff like that. So you can mess around with that. And uh, there's a setting also here. Um, let me see, can we find it? Uh, select typed in view. Uh, select the typed item in the view using share wizard. There's a lot of them settings there that show you uh, where the dot <coughs> the dot jar will pop up. So uh, display the file icon on thumbnails. There's a load of them there. Just mess around with it and you can get it. Um, but yes, it should be on Minecraft or on Minecraft, like I said. You will need to archive a program. I suggest using Winner or uh, 7-Zip. So you want to right-click on it. You want to go open with Winner Archiver, and this will pop up. This is your Minecraft.jar, and uh, you can leave this window open where it's in bin. Put that aside, 
<coughs> and you want to get this full screen. So in here you'll have a bunch of folders and class files. The first thing you want to do is delete the Meta INF folders. So you want to right click on it. You want to go delete files. This is how you sure you want to press yes. Okay. Now we're going to get the mod loader. So you want to click on the mod loader. It'll open up in winner. And what you want to do then is go back on your minecart.jr. Get your mod loader. Just going to shorten this folder down. You want to copy all the class files up to the very top. N not Don't go on top of that folder. Just go to the class files. Drag them into the class files inside the minecart.jr. Make sure it's on add and replace files. Press OK. And now you can exit the mod loader that is installed. Now you want to go for your audio mod. Click on that. And you want to do the exact same thing. You want to go back in your minecart.jr. Highlight the two folders in the class file and drag them in down with the class file. Make sure it's on add and replace files. Press OK. And now we're going to go on to the guy API. And now you want to open this up, put it aside. You want to drag all these in. So you want to highlight it from the very top down. Don't get the top folder. Make sure you just get the DE folder down to the very bottom. And scroll up and make sure you've got every file. Drag it in down with the class file. Next start extracting. And make sure it's on add and replace files. Press OK and we'll start extracting. And then you can exit out of your side your minecart.jr. Now we are finished with that. So you can exit out of that. And you can exit out your guy API. So we're only left with the doctor's area more creatures. So then I click on that. And you'll see mods and resources folder. So what you want to do is go back onto the bin folder that we left open. Press the back arrow or just click the dot minecraft at the top. If you exit out of that, just type in percent app data percent and go to Roman and click the dot minecraft and it'll bring you in here where the bin resources and saves there. So first of all what we want to do is click on the resources folder inside your dot minecraft. And you'll see um, a bit of more folders. So what you want to do is click on the resource folder inside the more creatures. It'll have a mod folder. You want to drag that mod folder into the dot .minecraft and start extracting and it should be in your dot .minecraft resources. So just drag them in and click the top folder. Double click it. It'll bring you back or just open up the more creatures again. Now you can all you have to do is press the back arrow. Press the dot .minecraft and you'll have a mods folder. So what you want to do with this if you don't have a mods folder already here, um, you shouldn't, unless you had any other mods installed. I just want to drag it over, and uh, that should work. Just drag it over, and exit out of everything, and open up your Minecraft, and just play. Let's just run this, and log in. So we can exit out of this, more creatures. Um, but this is a very, very cool mod. Um, it's so fun to play with, and all that, so yes. Uh, so like I said, it it's just it makes Minecraft more um, more joyful, more uh, exploration, uh, uh, more fun. There's so many things you can do with more creatures. Like you can do breeding with horses. I know uh, not just brought in uh, breeding animals in 1.9. I uh, can't wait for that. But uh, yes, I'm just gonna put down my render distance because uh, it tends to lag, especially when I'm recording. But we can see, if you press start, you'll see options, global mod settings, and you'll see the doctors are small creatures, and you'll see all that, so that is working. Now I just want to show you a few animals, if I can get near some. Just lag. And let's see, can we find some? Or do I have this on peaceful? No, I don't. So if you're in a world that you had and you've got this installed, you might have to start walking around for a bit of time and see can you find some. Because uh, if it's already rendered in, uh, the, it won't spawn them there, so that's what you need to do is walk around and get to a new place and you will find them spawning. But at the moment, I'm trying to find some. And uh, Minecrafts tend to be a bit laggy. So, go around. If I don't get some in a minute, I'm gonna create a new world and hopefully they'll be there beside me because the forest does not help. But maybe the water might have some. Um, there you go. I don't know if you can see that, but uh, there's them bears over there on the other side. And I'll just put all 
this fish. Hello, fishy. So, I'm just going to put my render distance on fair, and I'll leave it at that, guys. So, if you have any problems installing this, just leave a comment, and I will get back to you. And, uh, also leave a rating, it helps, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.